Something happened over the weekend and I thought that I wanted to include you in this video today because this is about my child but it's also about all of our children. Johannesburg Zoo bathroom with my toddler and I opened the door because cubicles get too small when you're busy doing and wiping and as I open the cubicle and I want to pull up pants and wipe I see a woman standing behind me and my child alerted me to it because she understands the notion of stranger. So she shows me there's a woman behind me and the minute I turn around I see uh, a lady in maybe her late 50s standing with her arms, arms folded watching us in the toilet. But we're the last cubicle so in order for her to get there she had to walk through the toilet and then lean in basically against the wall to watch us. So I look up and I say to her can you give us some privacy, please? Because I'm busy with my child. And she says, no, don't worry. Um, I'm just looking. And I got a fright and I said to her, you're a stranger and I'm asking you for privacy. And the more I'm asking her, she's raising her voice and she feels a sense of entitlement rose towards my child who's standing naked and I'm busy with her. I'm in the toilet. And she says to me, if you want privacy, you need to close the door. And I was really shocked because... She felt that she had a right, mm. just because she has eyes, to stand there in Akis Biosig met my kind. Then she says something else that's really scary. She says, I'm a grandmother, and I can look at your child because I have grandchildren too. And she's justifying the fact that she is entitled to be my child's granny, even though she's a complete stranger. Now, there's two things at play. Sure, I'm in the public eye and people sometimes feel that they know us and they can look at us or touch our children or uh, be kiss, a, kiss on them the on the oh. mouth. What would you have done as a mommy? I would have done what you did. I would have said to her, you, we, I, I would like privacy for my child because even from a young age, if I think about James, we tell him he's allowed to have privacy and he mm. asks for it sometimes if he's changing or anything like yeah. that. Yeah, and so he's, he's small, he's four. He's four. So for a stranger then to come in and invade that privacy and think that that's okay, I would have also said to her, no, you might be a granny, but you are not my child's granny. And for me as a parent, I get to say where that line is. How dare you? Because you're the to... mommy. Yes, exactly. I want to today... Um... I want to ask, we live in a time that's not like before. I want to ask our grannies and our mothers that we be careful around other people's children. Even though we think that they are cute and we appreciate that. But let's be careful around because her experience from that day is not about the zoo. It's about the lady she was scared yeah. of. Thanks. Thank you. Jacaranda.